If we left right now, it would take us nine months to get to Mars. Uh, no, no, you can't leave right now. You have to leave when Mars and Earth are properly aligned. You have to travel to where Mars will be when you get there. So it's a matching of trajectories that matters here. And so it, what we call the minimum energy trajectory. So it's one where you burn your engines and then you shut them off, then you coast to Mars until Mars pulls you into its gravitational influence and then you fall towards Mars. That takes about nine months. But if you run your engines the whole time, which we can't do yet because we don't know how, because we don't have enough fuel, if we had filling stations along the way, you could do this. You fill up, burn your engines, and then you're accelerating to Mars. By the way, that will give you gravity, artificial gravity, inside the ship, if the ship is accelerating. And then, but to slow down, you have to turn the ship around and then accelerate to slow down. Anyhow, if you do that, you can get to Mars in weeks, a few weeks. But it'll take a boatload of fuel to do that.